Hello, this is Masood Parvez. Uh, today, I am going to show you how to fix 500 zero server error in the Elementor or any kind of website. So, I have updated this banner for, for my website and now I am going to update. So, let's see what's happened. It's showing server error 500 zero. So, now I am going to show you how to fix this uh, from your cPanel. So, uh, I have uh, the cPanel, I am going to my cPanel and after going this cPanel, I am searching PHP, P PHP version, right, Cle I am clicking on this, uh, there is my op uh, domain name, so now I am going to select option, so there is option, native option, current option, I will select uh, my latest option. I have to change the memory limit so I can see uh, the memory limit is 128 MB but I will change it to maximum size and I will change post size too. I am changing the maximum size. Okay, now I will apply. So. Let's see what's happened in my website. After changing that, I am clicking on the update. Another option and another way. I will show you that too. So if this doesn't work for your website, so we can uh, do using plugin. So for the plugin, I have to add a new plugin and I'm going to search that WP Optimize. So this is the plugin WP Optimize Gas Clean Compress by David Anderson. I will use this website already. I have installed it and activated it. So I'm going to my plugin list. You can see the plugin is here. So I'm click on the settings and I will clean our all the database so there is an option optimize I have to optimize so I click and select this uh, option all option already selected now I will click run on the selected optimize option so it's cleaning and optimizing all expect database and auto draft post etc so after completing the database optimization i will go back to my website and check again what happened there okay uh, we can see the database optimization completed and update something so i'm going to element again and i will change so if i click on the video and copy the video link and going back to the website and updating it suppose this salam 30 okay so i'm aging it and click on the update okay great so there is no server error so if i load the website in my another browser I will see what is happening the uh, in the another browser I have uh, loaded the website and see the updated the all has been changed and updated thank you guys for watching my videos if you face any more other WordPress issue problem please let me know I will solve your any kind of website error and problem